Hi, I'm Laura Heritage. This is the third video in SOA Software's API management series. In this video, we're going to focus on the consumption of the API. I'm going to be pretending to be an app developer. I'm going to create an app. I'm going to access the API, and then I'm going to test the API. If you want to do this yourself, you can request a free trial from SOA Software at SOA.com. I'm going to log into the Acme Developer Portal as a developer to consume the wishlist API. So I'm going to click on log in. I'm going to log in with my Google credentials because I've already um, created an account. The first thing I need to do is create a new app in order to consume the API. Uh, this is going to be my gift app. I am not good at creating names. So I'm going to use that. It's going to be 1.0. Uh, I'm going to have it staging, take, uh, retail, and a gift are the tags I'm going to give it. This visibility of this app is going to be public, um, manages wishes, and this is going to be a beta. And I have a URL for my app. I'm just going to make it my name. And the next thing I'm going to do is upload an image. Pretty easy. I'm going to give it a green image. You don't have to do this, but it's fun, so I, I, I like doing it. Going to save it. And now we've created an app. The next thing I, I'm going to do is look at the services and subscribe to the wishlist service. There's my wishlist service that I want to use. I want to use the 1.0 version. I'm going to click access. It's going to take me a little through a little wizard to access it. Click add. I'm going to use my application that I created to subscribe to this API. Um, I want to use the sandbox endpoint. Uh, there's terms of use for using this sandbox endpoint, which you can read. I can read. Um, I'll accept those terms. and then save. And now I've activated to use the wishlist API. I can test the API now. Go to my dev console, select my wishlist API that I've subscribed to. I can see my app ID and secret that will be passed along with the request. I can click run it and you can see I've got all of the wish wishes out of the API. And that's how I subscribe to and use an API. Thank you for watching the third video in SOA Software's API management video series on how to consume an APIs from an app developer perspective. If you'd like to try a free trial of SOA Software's API management system, you can find a free trial at SOA.com. Hope you watch the next few videos in our series as well. Thank you.